Hi guys, welcome back. I'm really excited to be back with a nail art tutorial after quite the leave of absence. Life outside of YouTube has been quite hectic and busy for me over the last while, plus I ended up getting sick with the seasonal flu, so my voice wasn't sounding all that camera ready, if you will. I've got some really exciting things happening behind the scenes, which will be revealed at a later date. Feel free to follow me on my other socials to be kept in the loop with the exciting news. I know it's technically still winter, but I really wanted to do something off season that was bright and fun. If you guys want to see how I achieved this look, you're in the right place, so keep on watching. I'm starting out by applying two thin coats of a white nail polish and sealing it in with a top coat. To protect my skin from the upcoming nail art, I'm applying a liquid latex barrier on my skin surrounding my nails and cuticle area. For the base of this look, I'll be creating a vertical gradient, which is something I haven't done in a really long time as I typically go with horizontal gradients. For this look, I'll be using two nail polishes from Fresh Paints in the shades Honeydew and Bonna Blue. Using those two nail polishes, I'm starting out by applying Honeydew to one half of a cosmetic wedge and Bonna Blue to the other half in a vertical direction. And next, I'm dabbing the sponge over top of my nail, going in a slight side to side in up and down motion as it helps to achieve a flawless blend. I want to build the opacity of this gradient, so I'm going in again by applying more nail polish to the cosmetic wedge and repeating the same dabbing motion twice more. Using a pair of tweezers, I'm peeling off the latex barrier and going in with nail polish remover paired with a cleanup brush to clean up my cuticle and sidewall area of any lingering nail polish. For some fun added sparkle, I'm applying one coat of dragon dust from beyond the nail, followed by one thin coat of a quick drying top coat and allowing that to completely dry before moving on to the next step. Next, I'm taking this swirly image from Lena Nail Art Supply Snapping Plate Make Your Mark 05 paired with the new Twinkle Tea Stainless Steel Clear Stamper and Twinkle Tea Stamping Polishes in the shades Goals and Bothered. Using these two stamping polish colors, I'm going to be blending them both together to create a horizontal gradient design and picking that up with my stamper and transferring it over top all nails. To seal in the design, I'm using the new Clear Jelly Stamper Smear Not Smudge Resistant Top Coat. And as you can see, it does a fantastic job in keeping all the nail art intact and smudge free. So here we have the final and completed look and I hope you guys enjoyed today's tutorial even if it was an off season look. Thank you guys so much for watching and don't forget to give this a thumbs up if you enjoyed watching and I would love to hear your thoughts down below. I hope to see you back in my next video and until then remember creativity is at your fingertips. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!